What's up, fam? You probably clicked on this video because your Peacekeeper loadout is trash and you're looking for the best loadout for it. Or you're just bored out of your mind and need something to watch. Either way, you've come to the right place. In my previous loadout video, you guys requested that we drop a Peacekeeper class setup next, so here we are. I've been on a journey of finding the best loadout for this gun on stream. As we were trying out different attachments, gear, perks, I was gonna slaughter, fam. Like, I was gonna slaughter back. <laughs> These BO4 lobbies are ruthless nowadays, and don't let people know that you're trying to be a YouTuber on top of that. Like, it's just, like, because it's just gonna get you, like, your body shot every single time. All day, every day, body shot. Prah! all Stop. freaking day bro like it's, it's ridiculous sometimes it seems like every time i'm trying out a new loadout or something different you would think that i was playing a mr b's one million dollar black ops 4 tournament and for an older game it's like folks are still not messing around like i really be playing against some full-blown full party kd warriors like for real and drop your KD in the comments. Don't ask me for mine though. Like I am just a camo queen, you know, like challenge queen over here. Like that's what I be grinding. Man, and I'm stay at home mama though. Don't get it twisted. Like I will still drop you off, but you know, I'm just, I'm just letting you know. Don't get it twisted. We can still do something, you know, one off done ship every now and then. I, I be chilling though, I be chilling though for real. But in this gameplay, we were playing some safeguard on fire range map and it's definitely one of my favorite maps, so I enjoyed it. All right, let's get into this class setup. By the way, fam, do y'all say loadout or class setup? It really means the same thing to me, so I say both. All right, for our peacekeeper, it's it's like a really ironic name, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> we have the ELO site for our optic, quick draw, stock, hybrid mags, and rapid fire. For gear, we are using cosmic device, and for our perk, we're running scavenger. Before we dive deeper, fam, let's get this video to 20 likes. I know we can do it, and I appreciate you, fam. Back to this loadout. I personally don't like the iron sight, like the look of it on the peacekeeper. It honestly feels like it's bulky or like gets in the way. So I just use the ELO site. It's easier to aim with and it just looks better in my opinion so i'd be putting the purple one on mine i don't know what y'all put but that's what i do with mine quick draw is going to give us uh, the ability to aim faster and have stock on there too is going to help us with the recoil with this gun so it doesn't have much so it's not like it's going to be hard for us to control Hybrid Max is great for a bit more ammo and reloading faster, but I actually wish this gun probably just had extended max instead, but as y'all know, I'm addicted to reloading anyway, so I guess it just would have made a difference for me. Then we have Rapid Fire, which is just going to help us shred through the enemies even faster. And now that I'm thinking about it, I think like if they had Rapid Fire 1 and 2 on here, if that was an option, that would be absolutely insane, like no lie. Then Cosm Dice is low key like a must if you're a solo player nowadays because you're usually going up like a full freaking stack party teams. Like, that's who I'd be going up against. Then there's Scavenger perks. So, this is just going to allow us to pick up ammo from all the goofies that we just dropped off. But feel free to, you know, switch it up the gear, switch out the perks because you can always just run Crash for extra ammo. In this match, I was running the battery operator to get some of my challenges done. As you all know, we on that 100% challenge guy. I am at like, I think like 97 or 98%. I don't know, we gotta check. At least for multiplayer. I haven't done the other ones. I don't know if I'm going to. I don't think I should. I think I'm gonna just move on to a new cause. I ain't gonna lie. Sometimes I do wish this gun at least had FMJ1 on it. So you can shoot through certain walls and objects, especially when you're playing on maps like Nuketown. Like this gun just, I don't know, it just feels like a mini ICR to me. Kind of like the GKS, but like with a longer range. Like, let me know what y'all think of it in the comments and how you set up your Peacekeeper. I might try them out in the future. All right, so now that you have a solid class setup, make sure you're rocking a fire gun camo too so you can flex when you get the best play, fam. In this gameplay, I was running the solar flare camo. This is probably one of my favorite ones in the game, right next to Dark Matter and Diamond. So I, I don't even remember how I unlocked it, but I might have got it from the black market. I'm not really sure. I just love the colors on it. It's reactive camo, so it's going to change colors depending on the amount of kills you have. Let me know down below what's your favorite camo or some of your go-to ones. 
as we're starting to get deeper into 2024 happy new year by the way there is going to hopefully be a new cod dropping this year called go for and i'm saying hopefully because unfortunately sometimes they do just push back release dates but i'm hoping it doesn't get pushed back so with that being said this year is more than likely going to be my last year of uploading content on black house 4 videos and live streams unless y'all really want them to keep coming plus if i got the the money i'm going to like be pre-ordering that new call of duty so let me know what y'all expecting out of it a lot of people still try to convince me to play modern warfare 3 or the new updated warzone and i enjoy mw2 and warzone 2 but mw3 is just not my style I've always been a Black Ops fan, and that's why after all these years, I always just go back to the Black Ops series games, plus Black Ops 2 is my first Call of Duty game I ever had, so comment below what your first Call of Duty was, fam, and shoot, back then, I was on Xbox, like, Xbox 360, that was our first COD we ever had. So, I'm going to be putting out a lot more Black Ops 4 videos before I retire this game, so the new players, even those... People that want to come back to the game can still have the best loadouts to run with. But Black Ops 4 will always be one of my favorite Call of Duty games. I don't think I've grinded any other, like, COD game or game at all more than this one, to be honest with you. So, as far as doing the whole camo grind and being almost done with the 100% challenges for multiplayer, some of y'all were telling me to reset my account. <laughs> Just for, like, the reset banner. I'm like, that's so not worth it to be like what so i'm going to keep making the loadout videos for y'all then move on from this game like to be honest that's that's kind of the plan at least yeah that's like the current plan for now but if y'all want more of these types of videos years from now just let me know we could shoot we could grind out bo4 as long as y'all want i'm kind of getting over it though i'm like shoot we got new cars dropping i ain't playing that modern warfare i'm good off that though I'm like that's gonna be a waste of my money just how i wasted my money on 2k24 Nope, I will never buy another 2K. I'm over it, bruh. But yeah, speaking of new players too, they be selling me, they be selling me. They be selling me bad, bad. They be going like four and thirties, like crazy stuff, bruh. It's like, like, like I really be getting teammates nowadays who can't get five kills a game and they just don't leave. They just don't leave the game at all. Like, like going four and 30, just like every game is insane i think i've only gone like 4 and 30 ever and that was a 1v1 i'm pretty sure bro was cheating <laughs> and i knew i should have 1v1 and i'm like he might be cheating but i'm like whatever i don't care it is what it is folks be cheating that's another thing though folks to be cheating nowadays i got another video coming up on that too but yeah they be letting people get gunships like on the other team and all and i'm like fam i could only carry you so much like who do you think i am like what <laughs> it would be one thing if we were playing like like search and destroy and i don't know but getting less than five kills in like tdm or domination or hard point is just wild to me like maybe it's got me thinking like maybe the lobbies are just too sweaty for new players i don't know anymore it probably is though my teammates definitely sold me in this game though too. Like I dropped 60 plus kills and like I scored at the rest of like the robot the most, but I just couldn't do it all by myself this time. You know, sometimes you just take the L, it is what it is. But let me know how you do with randoms on your team because the struggle is real for me playing solo. Sheesh. But yeah, if I'm also fam, I would also love to put out like more friendly 1v1 videos. So if you want to 1v1 me or anyone else and want it to be uploaded on this channel, just let me know. We can even do some wagers on or off stream for not more than $25 though. Let's not do more than $25. Some people just talk about, oh, let's do $400 wages. I'm like, who, who got just $400 to be like putting on a Black Ops 4 1v1? Apparently y'all rich. Please tip on stream or just play. <laughs> But yeah, I'm not gonna do it for like more than $25. So we can even do like the 1v1s be $5 each, three rounds, win $5, whatever. It could be on the low low. Whatever the case, y'all can add to the pot. Usually we're gonna do that through like Cash App, stuff like that. If you don't got Cash App, I don't know what to tell you. Just don't participate, bro. Last time I did this and someone didn't have Cash App and he participated and he literally won. And then I had to like DM him. 
uh, uh, the PlayStation gift card for $25 instead of just sending him the $25 directly. And then he told me, he was like, well, I'm out of the country. I also can't take the $25. I was like, yeah, I don't know why you participate, <laughs> but I'm like, okay. Bro. I sent him the, the code anyways. I'm like, hey, bro, it is what it is. But yeah, fam, um, I'm not rich, so yeah, that's why it's only gonna be $25. I make zero dollars and zero cents from YouTube. I make my little pennies off of Twitch, but I make no money from YouTube, okay? Zero, zero. Unless y'all tip on stream, then I, I would make something. But as of right now, we ain't monetized, we don't make nothing. Zero. Brokey, broke, 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 YouTuber. <laughs> All right. But I think it would be another fun way for all of us to hang out on stream and have a little bit more competition. And don't run to the comments with your hater comments either. Talk about how much I suck at the game. Then, then y'all be dodging my ones like for months. It's crazy. But yeah, fam, these will be family friendly 1v1s and a way for us to just collab on videos too. And so let me know in the comments if you're interested in that. Our next video dropping is going to be on the KM57. This gun is so good. I almost dropped 100 kills again with it, fam. So make sure to subscribe with post notifications on to not miss out on that video and watch this past setup video next, fam. God bless. Eliminate.